All right, you know, I am lazy. That's why I made this let me animate plugin, which lets you animate without making any keyframes. But then I got even more lazy. So I made this new plugin preset, which if you drag and drop on any clip, it will give you this slide animation. I'm gonna call this plugin let me slide. And if you want any other slide, let's say you want to slide up, then you just select up. Now it will slide up. And similarly, if you want to slide down, just select slide down. It will slide down. And if you want a custom slide, then you can just click on this free mode. And now you can position your custom starting position. Then it's going to come from that position to your default position. And of course, you have all the easy options and all the necessary options you would need. You also have this directional blur slider. And if you like the standard motion blur, it's also available. And once I made this plugin, I thought why not create a transition version. So I made it. If I drop this transition to this clip, you can see it has all the same features. In this transition, you can adjust the timing from here. And you have all the up, down, left, right, everything you have seen before. But you know, it's a transition. So you can also use it as a transition. I know that's genius. So you can drag and drop. So then it will have a transition. <laughs> And you can have different transition from different clips. So this is the end of the clip. So end slide, you can make it go left. So this logo will go left and uh, my character will come up. Then you have this fade option. Now, if I want the transition to fade in, which gives a better look, I can just tick this box. So it will give you this fade out slide animation. Pretty cool. Uh, I need, I still need to work on this transition one, but this effect one is complete. So you can download this effect one and try it yourself and you can give me any feedback so that I can improve it and it's completely free. So you can download it from my Patreon. There are a few more plugins that I have been working on. For example, if I take this, it is a zoom plugin then it will have this smooth zoom nothing special mr alex tech also have a plugin magic zoom which works great but i wanted some extra features like this preview option so this is zoomed but i don't know how much it has zoomed so i can just click on this preview option it will show me the whole image and also show me the area that it's going to zoom so from here i can uh, select how much i want to zoom so let's select from this L to this A. Now if I turn off the preview, then it will show me the zoomed version. So this is very handy feature if you are uh, animating, let's say a map animation. And also you have all the other features. If you want only zoom in, then just select zoom in. It will have only zoom in. By default it's both. And if you select continuous, then it will continuously zoom in until the clips ends. Okay, so these are some plugins that I have been working on. Uh, you can try the position one from my Patreon and I am currently working on the other two. So let me know if you have any ideas on the zoom in plugin or uh, the other plugin that I have shown you. I would love to improve it. So let me know in the comment section and I'll see you in the next video.